dear student today we will learn chapter number 4 altitude and medians of a triangle if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe it today itself let's start altitude of a triangle what do you mean by altitude of a triangle or what is the altitude of a triangle the perpendicular segment drawn from a vertex of a triangle on the side opposite to it is called an altitude of the triangle okay so we will try to understand this with the help of example here i have taken a triangle pqr right it has three corners corner p corner q corner r and each corner of this triangle is known as vertex of a triangle so we will choose one of the vertex in this figure you can see i have taken p as a vertex now i am going to make a perpendicular segment from vertex p to its opposite side qr okay you can see qr is opposite to p now i am going to make a perpendicular segment from p to opposite side qr okay you can see that this segment is perpendicular we'll name this segment seg ps so seg ps is perpendicular segment and this segment is called as altitude of triangle pqr so in triangle pqr seg ps is an altitude on the base qr ortho center of a triangle a triangle has three altitudes the altitudes of a triangle are concurrent concurrent means they passes through a single point the point of concurrence of the three altitudes of a triangle is called the ortho center okay so what is ortho center it is a point where all altitudes meet each other we will try to understand ortho center with the help of example look at here we have taken a triangle abc now we will make altitude from each vertex to its opposite side first we will take vertex a now i am going to make a perpendicular from vertex a to its opposite side bc okay you can see it is a perpendicular segment so seg ax is one of the altitude of triangle abc now we will choose the another vertex and we will make a perpendicular from it okay you can see i have made a perpendicular from vertex b to its opposite side ac okay that is seg by now we will make a perpendicular from vertex c okay you can see that i have made a seg cz perpendicular to ab so in this figure seg ax seg by and seg cz are the three altitudes of a triangle and you can see that they meet each other at one and only one point and that point is o ortho center is usually denoted by o so what is ortho center it is a point where all three altitudes meet each other median of a triangle what do you mean by median of a triangle the segment joining the vertex and the midpoint of the opposite side is called the median of a triangle we will try to understand median of a triangle with the help of an example here we have triangle hfc now we will take any one of the corner of this triangle we will choose one of the vertex of vertex of this triangle say the vertex is h okay now what is side opposite to h fc and you can see that i have taken m as a midpoint of opposite side fc now we will join point m with vertex h okay we will join vertex h with the midpoint of opposite side fc okay you can see that seg hm is median of triangle hfc so in triangle hfc m is midpoint of side fc therefore seg hm is the median of this triangle okay so what is a median it is a segment which joins vertex of a triangle and midpoint of its opposite side centroid of a triangle what do you mean by centroid of a triangle you know that every triangle has three medians okay it has three corners from each corners we will get one median the medians of triangle are concurrent 
concrete means all three medians passes through a single point or you can say they meet each other at a single point the point of concurrence of the three medians of a triangle is called a centroid what is centroid it is a point of concurrence of all the three medians or you can say that it is a point where all three medians meet each other now we will try to understand centroid of a triangle with the help of figure see here i have taken a triangle pqr now we will choose one of the vertex of this triangle say here p is the vertex now we will join vertex p with the midpoint of side qr so we will take the midpoint of qr you can see that in this figure a is midpoint of qr now we will join point p with a okay here seg pa is one of the median of this median of this triangle pqr now we will take another vertex q and we will join q with the midpoint of its opposite side what is opposite side of q pr and what is the midpoint of pr that is c so we will join point q with c so c is the midpoint and q is the vertex so say qc is the median of this triangle now we will make a median from vertex r to its opposite side pq so look at in this figure b is midpoint of side pq now we will join point b with vertex r okay so say rb is the another median of this triangle okay so this triangle has three median that is say pa seg qc and seg rb and you can see that all three medians meet each other at single point okay and that point is called as centroid of a triangle usually we denote centroid with the letter g okay so what is centroid it is a point where all three medians meet each other